Hello everybody, Mikey Dare Panzernator here with Hearts of Iron 4. We are playing as the Confederated States of America. And we are hopefully not going to die because, well, we have a lot of enemies. And uh, we probably pissed some of them off. So, there we go. We have the Bureau of Ships, which is awesome. And let's go with Carrier Primacy so we can get better Carrier Models. So, double check on the Bureau of Ships did. It gives us some naval XP, and it gives us uh, basically minus 5% production cost across the board. And uh, yeah, and so we're gonna get some bonuses for carrier technology. Oh, hold up. Second Mexican Civil War. All right, so if you have the over, under, ooh, Martinez and Cardenas, ooh, 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 ooh. Who is who? Okay, so the Mexican Republic has joined the Axis. So we basically have World War II has brought itself up into the New World. The forces of church and revolution have once again come into conflict in Mexico. With the government renewing its attack on the church, the embattled Catholic priest and social movements are... Uh, are launching an armed rebellion to seize control of Mexico. Sistero Milita Militas are ref uh, Sistero militias are reforming after a decade of inactivity, supplemented by defectors from the federal military. They have taken over several rural states and are using them as a base from which to operate. The first Cristada ended with a settlement of negotiation between Senor senior revolutionary and church officials thanks to intermediary by the American government but it looks like that this violence will end only with the complete destruction of one of the belligerents. The Mexican situation seems too complex for an outsider to understand. So are you... Who's the church people? I think you're the... I think the... Oh, I, I think they're the church people. Something tells me, you know, maybe the, the giant cross on their flag tells me this. A senator... Supports. Ah, oh, thank you. Thank you, Senator. Thank you, Cocaine Mitch. Ah, yes. Got just my microphone a little bit. Make sure it's all good. My, I, my apologies for being highly unprofessional at all times. So, this army doesn't consume any fuel. We could, um, we could continue exercising our planes to generate some air XP, but that just has losses these guys are pretty pretty veteran as it is um, veterans of the war okay so what have we done we have gotten all this let's uh focus on let's focus on the convoys but we're definitely going to need some new ones so in this uh this new world that we live in Let's let's just start. Let's just infinite produce escort carriers, escort cruisers. Um, let's put these up here. Let's infinite produce those and as well escort destroyers. Let's do that. Uh, but before we do that, let's me, let me build. How many minesweepers do you think we need? Probably like a hundred's too many. Let's do 10 minesweepers. And I want these to be deployed to Tampa. Okay, so there we go. We're gonna build a minesweeping fleet. And then we're gonna put, yeah, we're gonna put these on, on repeat. And, uh, well, instead of escort fleet one, let's just do you to New Orleans. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna put everyone in new, no, let's not. Can I undo that? Can I like undo where I want you to deploy? Just make you go to auto. Uh, it appears not, but I could delete you. Let's just do one in Louisiana. No, but you need to be an escort fleet one. So let's do that. <laughs> we'll just leave these on auto. I don't know what auto where auto is going to put them because whenever I try and drop another another thing. Okay, so there we go. We'll see how this goes. Get our minesweepers rolling. And now we can get a ship designer. I am going to get Newport, new shipbuilding. Get that. Get that, uh. 
that max range. So we got an improved computing machine. That is excellent. Let's get decryption and encryption. Where can uh, where can a man find himself an extra research lot? Or as the fascist, we don't get extra research lots. Maybe we should have done that before we started the Civil War. Yep, it looks like we're, we're stuck on four research slots. That's fine. We'll probably be okay. Let's put you on the Mexican border. You can't, you never know with these people. Um, there's, it's also extremely lopsided. So you know what? We're gonna, we're gonna delete your orders there. And we're just gonna tell you to uh, do a fallback line. Kind of like that. I do want it to. I do want it to extend it. There we go. That's good. So we'll give up this one province, Juarez. So um, Mexico is <laughs> Mexico is in a civil war. What's new? What is new? All right. So we could get these twelve divisions out in training, and as many of these as possible. That's a lot. Okay, but we need the XP. We need the army XP. 31,000 manpower. We need more men. I re we require more men. It's just the way it is. Okay, so could I like duplicate this fleet? Depth charge mortar. That's pretty good. Alright, what else do you want? Ooh, I could get a snorkel. Snorkels are good. Hmm. 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 Smokescreen is something that's pretty cool. Torpedo attack. Okay. Uh, in the year 1940, what should we get? I think we need better... Well, we're focusing on the Navy, right? So let's get as many modules as possible. Like, uh, let's get the inclined belt cruiser armor scheme. Let's get that. Use our naval XP. So are you almost ready? Oh, you're just waiting on that uh, cruiser, which should be done on September September 9th. Impressive. Do, 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 do. Confederate flags is a song in the, his game. Ooh, look at this. Is the Mexican Republic going to win or is Mexico going to win? Is the Mexican Civil War? Ooh, it's just Mexico. I think I think they took Mexico City, didn't they? Oh wow! I think the Catholics are gonna win, which is great and all. But legacy of the revolution. Wait, are they trying to bring back Trotsky? Oh, they might be trying to bring back Trotsky in normal Mexico. This is just so bizarre. What is going on here? The world. What is happening to the world? Okay, so we got... Ooh, synthetic oil experiments. Finally, we can get some rubber. Alright, so it's 1940. We need to... We need to up our navy, get some better modules. Uh, we're not going to get bonuses for heavy ship hulls, I don't think. If we look at this, so we're just going to get carrier bonuses here. And then submarines, light hole. Yeah, so in terms of research bon bonuses, only really carriers. So, and I think submarines. So let's um, let's get some heavy ships rolling, shall we? Let's let's start getting some heavy ship designs, so we can build up that big, big, big navy gonna be huge y u comma to the top g e wait there's no comma to the top there's no apostrophe in huge it's going to be huge trotsky survives assassination attempt oh no i think we're gonna see trotsky either in this mexico probably not that mexico or in the soviet union have you purged yet oh, he's purged okay well, but Communist China seems to be holding their own. They have 18 to 25. So they're, they are, they're definitely outnumbered, but we'll see what happens. We will see what happens.
This is confusing. Sh this is Shanxi. King Carol the Second abdicates. Amusing. So, who are you? Wait, are they going? Co what, what is going on with the world? I don't know. World War Two is just raging on in Europe. I'm just kind of chilling here, like, hey. Ooh. So we have a bunch of new guys here. So let's put you in this army. And we'll put you under this guy for now. And, well, we got to start somewhere. So let's start in the northeast, where I think it's most likely a naval invasion will come. So there we go. We're going to start doing all of this. And I'm probably going to have to check on this between episodes. This just seems a little, um, little... It just rambunctious. Queen China has declared one Sting Kang. Wait, what? They're way the hell over there. How are you going to kill them? Have you done the... Uh... Oh, they're, they're going to... I'm going to do all this. So what do we do? We got... So we have gotten carrier primacy, correct? All right. So this gives us naval bomber models and naval aircraft, radar submarine models and unlocks cruiser submarine holes. Let's get that, especially since what well, we're our navy is heavily reliant. Oh no. Oh no. Queen China, what have you done? Oh no. Uh oh. This this world is crazy. Oh yep. So uh they're at war with the Soviet Union. Oh my god. Queen China, what have you done? Puyi, no He's got a he's got quite the military. I must say, our, our military isn't we don't have much of a military here in the United States. Uh, uh, the Confederated States, shall I correct myself? Okay, well, uh the world's just falling apart and we're here to um see it. So we have our minesweepers which main battle fleet escorts. I don't know what we'll do with the minesweepers, but we'll um do something with them eventually. Have them clear mines. Sweep. Sweep for mines, I suppose. I mean, that, that is in the name, right? Who the hell are you? New Zealand, what are you doing? So, uranium mining. This this war is just ridiculous. What, what, is, what is the world war right now? How many wars are there? There's too many wars. And Japan is still fighting a civil war. Look at, look, Imperial Japan is holding their own. I am thoroughly impressed. This is terrifying now. Because, well, Queen China is going to die. Communist China is in its own faction somehow. Wait, is Communist China going to be... <laughs> uh, Communist China and the Soviets are fighting. Uh, this is so funny. Oh, it looks like the, the traditional... Me looks like normal Mexico is making a uh, comeback here. On the normal... On the normal... The, uh... The religious Mexicans. How's the Mexican Civil War going? No, not the Mexican Mile War. The, uh... German-Mexican War? I don't know. What is this world coming to? This is so funny. All right, wait. Ooh, we have some free civilian factories. All right, let's build some synthetic refineries. Let's build um them like in these states. That's probably going to be more than sufficient. And let's build some dockyards on the eastern seaboard. Let's try and build up our navy. There we go. And then let's uh, give every internal state a military factory. I'm trying to balance them out because I usually build everything very concentrated, but I don't want to do that this time. I want to, you know, I want to be different. All right, so there we go. That should do it. That should help our military out a bit. We shall see. We shall see. Da 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 da. Luftwaffe march. 
Alright, so hopefully we'll get some, uh, some infantry equipment here and there. That should help us out. Get some more military factories. And... Well, we're gonna get a bunch of infrastructure, which should just massively increase our our resource gain. Which is, which I mean, it's just gonna be comical how many resources we have. So I am going to cancel our rubber trade, just to see just to see what we can get. We may have to research it, but anyhow. All right, so we're getting our fleet submarines, which is pretty nice. We're we're we're, we're uh. These guys are just sitting here. I kind of want to... I'm going to exercise them just to generate some... Some air XP. Same thing with you. I'll do that. And then... Okay, so this uh, fleet is fully ready. So we're going to exercise them just to... Uh, to get their XP up and also, you know, we can always use some more... Naval XP. Okay, so you were the fleet submarines. What about you? Can any of you be upgraded? No ships are currently selected. Well, I want I want this I want this fleet. I don't think there's anything they can do. This is weird. I don't get wait, what is this thing? Okay, distributes and balance task forces. All right, so we want airplane designers and tank designers. And theorists too, I mean, it's just, ah, uh, so much to do, so much to see, so what's wrong with taking the back streets? Let's get a 1940 carrier hole. Let's get those, get those aircraft carriers built. Awesome sauce. Do, 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 do. So we are basically using all of our available men to uh, do things here. All right, so you are training up. Once these people, like how much, once they're like seasoned, the, I like how the Lexington is the escort carrier. Hold up. Did I put that in the escort carrier name list? No, can we do like none? Okay, whatever, it's fine. The Lexington should be a bigger carrier, but it's it'll do. They'll they'll help all of our all of our dudes. So disabled, high repair priority, high risk, do not engage, and get only engage at low risk. That's what I want the escort fleet to do. So let's look at this real quick before we go. Oh wait, no, let's um. There we go, we'll put you into here. And... All right, so we got two more guys, and they will defend New York. Have fun on, have fun on Broadway, dudes. Y'all probably have one of the better stations there is. I mean, New York is rebuilding after everything. Upgrade to what? Oh, I'm not upgrading you to a Yorktown. You're an escort carrier. Come on. We're not doing that. But anyways, that is all the time we... Wait, why did we change the free American empire? When did this happen? Did I, I did not get a pop-up or anything about that. I don't want to be the free American empire. I want to be the confederated states. I don't get it. Anyhow. We'll, we'll just deal with it. But uh, I hope you all enjoyed this episode if you did be sure to leave a like and consider subscribing to the channel thank you all so much for watching until the next one this is mikey derpanginator signing out see you nerds